What up YouTube, Kobe here, and I'm very excited to show you my X4 quadcopter with the brand new state-of-the-art Nazi board. Uh, we're going to open it up and do the unboxing here. This is from Foxtech.com, great company for all your FPV needs if you're doing any FPV. First thing I like to do before a box, open up the box and just show you how good it came packaged. I mean, this is waterproof. You could drop this in a puddle and it would survive probably 10 seconds in a puddle and not do anything to the box. So right off the bat, you're not going to get that quality. Completely waterproof. All right, so and I'm very excited to open this. I've been waiting probably eight hours till I got here for Christmas uh, vacation. Uh, my father's house to open it for you guys instead of in the car. <laughs> so see the packaging is pretty good here this is always the funny part you guys are like come on get it out all right so this is our final product box is in fairly good shape and it's sealed a little more. No problem. Alright. Factory sealed. That's what I like guys. Factory seals here has not been opened by anybody but the Feiyu Tech Factory. There you go. And you all get the first look before me. And what do we got? All right, this is the X4 quadcopter uh, with the Nazi board. Now this is the product right here. This is the what controls the quadcopter. This was a Nazi board. It was hard to get. It was on back order. Got everything here with it. It's the board itself. Looks like we got some uh, connectors for it. Now I have the FY30A. And it was very easy to connect. Very easy, very easy. So we got this uh, wiring, and now it looks like we got some type of harness here. Uh, looks like a. I'm gonna have to look over the instruction booklet, but I don't know what that is. Looks like a, some kind of connector for batteries. Uh, USB. Looks like some type of USB port, maybe for programming. And uh, USB cable. All right, so next we have the motors. All right, this is one of the four motors, two of the four, I should say. Nice black ones. I have one of the bigger one of these black ones. Um, I guess they're good motors. I haven't ever tested one out, but uh, they'll run on three S's supposedly. We know what's in there. Just two more motors. This is a 5.7 gigahertz transmitter. This was uh, just it's added on separate to the order. Um, now we got just like four props here. Uh, yeah, that's going to be uh, six props. So we get two extra props. They're anticipating us breaking some props. Okay. And we have zip ties. All right, this is the Feiyu Tech Door. Four 20 amp ESCs with the Dean's connector, and it looks like that's our instruction book right there. Uh, prop adapters, uh, different bits of hardware. Here's the main board itself. This board has LEDs. Uh, in it and auto land when it's running low on power so you're going to have to solder these but it's very basic soldering so it's a board run and then we have the new legs and stands <coughs> excuse me so uh they said it's about three hour four hour uh, build time ali shamo had did it so probably a night we got the hardware and The hardware and came with an Allen wrench. All right, guys. Well, that's it. And uh, I don't know how long till I get this together and get it in the air, but I definitely plan on doing that. So, 
Once again, uh, this is from foxtech.com. Uh, this is the main item here, was this Nazi board. This is brand new, just released uh, December, sometime in December. Uh, it's the most stablest board for your quadcopter. So uh, go ahead and pick one up at uh, foxtech.com. All right, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Cove out.